ba ba da ba ba Hey everyone, Maxwell P. Ryan here coming to you with a video review, the first in what will be a series of different video reviews of the different Star Wars buildable figures I've got. The first Order Stormtrooper, K2SO, Blaze Malbus, Chirrut Imwe, Darth Vader, General Grievous, and Django Fett. And so, we're going to start off with the one that I started with, with for my entire collection, Darth Vader. So this will be the video review of the Lego Buildable Figures, Darth Vader. And so, we're going to quick take him and put him off to the side here. And quick take a brief look at his box because, you know, you don't have to... We don't have to look at boxes, because I say so. So, box, Star Wars, ages, buildable figures, Star Wars, Star Wars, stuff, warnings, labels, things, and stuff, and obligatory product shots, you can do this, you can do that. Other thing, figures you can collect. That's it for the package. Now, Moving right along, here we have Darth Vader, and as you can see, he's Darth Vader. I know his knees aren't currently in the best position, but then again, eh. That was one thing I noticed with this figure. His knees were, and legs were kind of, eh. So, but yeah, um, here he is, and he's a very nice looking, uh, uh, figure uh, getting close here so we can see some of the detailing all around very nicely done I mean quite a bit there I mean even these side panels here are done in so yeah um accessory wise accessory wise uh, I'm gonna accessory wise he comes with his lightsaber and that just plugs into his hand via two star, red star pegs. And they can go on either side or if you like, what I like to do, or if you're not using them, what I like to do personally is simply kind of just connect them together right here and put it off to the side when you don't want them holding it. But for the most part, I generally have him holding his lightsaber because who doesn't like to have their light, who doesn't like to have their lightsaber on them, so... But yeah, so yeah, um, uh, we'll kind of go into some of the articulation now. Um, head is on a ball joint for lots of wiggle movement and rotation. Uh, shoulders are on also, this figure is mostly ball joints. So shoulders are on a ball joint, full rotation there. And then this can move, this shoulder pad can also move for nice in and out movement. Um, a little bit of swivel. Um, elbows can bend in both directions, and there's also a swivel there because of it being on a ball joint. So you can also do, have them there, bend there. You have a wrist swivel and lots of movement there. And legs can go forward that far before falling off, and they can go back all the way can go out, eh, not full splits, a uh, little bit of rotation, these can go back that far, they can go forward that far so you can have him break his leg, he break his leg, break him, breaks his legs, hum, and then you have a little, you have the ball joint here, quite squeaky, I don't know if you can hear that, but here, quite squeaky there, for a good range of movement there. And so yeah, um, cape. This cape is fabric, which is nice. Lots of movement and motion going on with there. So you can really strike some menacing poses with him. Here, just let me quick configure him. And there he is. That is that is Darth Vader in a semi-menacing pose. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, uh, not much else to really say about this guy except for he's cool. I mean, his back is, I mean, 
Here, I'm going to show you guys his back. This is his backside. That's pretty clean. So yeah, um, not much else to show with these. This guy, um, it says on his box what his height is. He is not the tallest. General Grievous is the tallest. And just quickly, kind of grabbing the box over here. This figure is 11.2 inches tall. Or for those of you who might be watching in the UK, 28.5 centimeters. So a very nice sized figure. About Combiner Wars. Uh, He's about the same, he's a, a tad bit shorter than uh, than Buzz Lightyear is. So, yeah, so we're going to put him back to where he was at. And so, um, stay tuned for my next review, which will be of General Grievous. I will be doing them in the order that I got them, which was General Grievous, Darth Vader, General Grievous, Django Fett, Stormtrooper, K2SO, and then these two. I will do two separate reviews for those two guys only because of the fact that they both are unique and I cut, I did something for this guy. So, I think that basically does it. So, this has been the video. This has been Maxwell P. Rhyme reviewing the St Lego Star Wars buildable figures Darth Vader. And this is Maxwell P. Rhyme asking you to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with whomever you think might like it, and I will catch you all next Catch you all next time, and don't forget to check me out on Facebook at Maxwell Rhyme Reviews, or go to the search engine or, and type up Maxwell's Reviews, or uh, go to the link in the description down below. Camera fall down.